You gotta do it. What's up, guys? We're actually going to her mom's house for dinner. They invited me. At first, they were kind of skeptical. They're like, oh, he's not gonna like our house. But I'm not a snob. Let's go eat, man. Let's go chill. Come on. It's all good, man. It was real cool how everybody received me. And I really don't get over to the province a lot. It's not because I'm a snob, but just because up, I'm always filming, always editing. Oh, wait. They're making pans. It. Check this out. Check this out. Now, that's good stuff right there, guys. Making pans it on an open fire. You got to love that. Oh, yeah. That's nice. Look at that, look at that. Now watch this flip. Flip, bam! That's how you do it, baby. Come on, guys, let's go. Papa! Ha ha ha. Pa is cool, you guys will see. Whenever you visit a Filipino's parents' house, always give a blessing. I, uh, I have the power! Pa, mama! Hello. Happy birthday, ma! You okay? You look like you're you are 21 today. <laughs> okay, Sha. Yo, we're gonna eat some food. Whoa, look at all the kids that came in here. Show them, show them. Say hey! <laughs> all the kids in the neighborhood are awesome, dude. You gotta love the Philippines, man. So cool. You guys know my Let's daughter stays to next to me always, every day. Oh yeah, you got the nice soup. Oh. Papa, is this synagogue? What's this? What is this one? Synagogue? What kind of soup is that, Pa? Oh, yeah. Uh, what do you guys know about this one? One of the family's famous recipes is Pansit, and her sister is keeping the legacy going with the Badu Pansit. Oh, yeah. Came out good, man. Thank you, sis. Thank you, sis. And of course, guys, rice is life. You got to have the rice. Put down a big, nice plate of rice. Pa, we got a good meal or what? Good meal. Good meal. We're going to have a good meal. God bless. your day with tasting. Ah, taste it and say, damn. All right, pans and taste test. Mmm. I feel it. I feel it. I feel it. <laughs> Damn. I had to do that it. It's amazing. Good job, Emery. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> oh, he's a professional man. So her brother just came in and he's been working. They haven't seen him a lot. He's got a new job. It's awesome. I have to get in the back. I'm kind of tall. I always love dad's prayer, man, because, you know, it's so heartfelt. And a lot of times he gets choked up, you know, because he's so happy. Because, you know, I came into Regine's life and blessed their family, you know. So sometimes he gets choked up, you know, but it's all right. He's a, he's a sensitive man. He feels everything, man. And feels the appreciation. It's all right, Papa T. Boar. Let it out, big guy. Amen. <laughs> and of course, you gotta sing the famous happy birthday. She really made a good wish. You can tell she was thinking about it. 
Check out the plate, guys. Now that's a real plate. You got the manuk. You got the baboy soup, man, with a little bit of rice. I ain't trying to go too crazy on the rice. But the best thing that they make around here is this pansy. Oh my God. Let's eat. Ha! Ah. Mm. It's got a real restaurant taste, you know? I always told her one day I want to invest in a restaurant. She's going to be cook. But you, Emery, so like if I buy a restaurant, right? Would you cook there? Why not? But I'm trying to think of what is the best buy business to invest in South Philippines. Who do you think? Sometimes I ask her dad about different investments that I could do here in the Philippines. Because I'm always looking at ways to, you know, make extra money with our growing family and stuff like that. And the fact that, you know, foreigners can't really work. You gotta be creative. And think of different in investments. Think of different ways that you can make money. So he thinks. So he thinks I should get into real estate. <clears throat> but real estate is not easy because you know what? Okay, if I own an apartment, right? My renter will call me. Please, my sink is broke. But in the Philippines, they don't come. They say fix it yourself. No. Potato. Go on the camera. Go on the camera. Make the make the. Okay. Yeah. You know you gotta have a royal. <laughs> that is like the official soft drink in the Philippines, yo. Y'all let me know in the comments if I'm wrong, but I don't think I'm wrong. Oh, I thought it was I thought it was a hair. <laughs> I actually thought it was a hair in the cup, but it was actually just a crack. <laughs> I'm crazy. But I thought it was like your hair body. That's how in the province. You got a lot of province, baby. I love chilling here though, man. Oh yeah. Mm. Oh, I'm, I'm almost full now. I'm almost full now. So I'm going to call you a problem. Okay, so tomorrow is... What is the place for? Oh, white sand. Nice water. Pa was actually asking me what is the plan for tomorrow. And when he says tomorrow, he's talking about my son's birthday. Because my mother in law's birthday is the seventh, <laughs> and my son, Marshawn's birthday, is actually the eighth, the next day. And I was telling her how we were going to go to a nice beach with white sand. We're going to get a cottage and just chill, man, in a cool resort. I'll be filming that as well, guys, and I'll be putting that up, too.
Your business, oh. This is the birthday girl, Mama Nini. This is my girl's mom. So, how do you feel having another birthday, Ba? Tell her, tell her in, in Bisaya. Happy day. I was trying to interview her mom, which was All the birthday girl, but you see, my son wants to be a vlogger as well. <laughs> he wants the mic. You want to be a vlogger also? So how does it feel by having all three generations of the Badu clan here? Very happy then. Uh, makes you happy? Me, yeah. <laughs> and another year, ba. What is unsang goal ka this year, ba? Sorry, good luck. Bisaya, 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 Bisaya. <laughs> I will subtitle, Bisaya. Work on children. <laughs> Damn! <laughs> But you can tell her she can speak Bisaya. So, unsang plan of this year? Pagan pa ug kanang taas na kinabuhi, good health, at upan sa kung pamilya. Unsang, what about Korta? I maybe. It's cool how humble she is. I asked her about money, and she said maybe. I got that capitalist mind state, that American mind state. I'm like, oh, your wishes aren't money? Okay, so, <laughs> you know, Quarta so, in Bisaya uh, or Tagalog. Quarta also? Yeah. <laughs> okay, how much Quarta? <laughs> wait, wait, wait. Unsa ka rich sa Philippines? Unsa, unsa ka rich? What, what is rich? Unsa kuan pa din, Murag. Monthly, monthly. <laughs> ah, think now, think now, ma, think now. Monthly. But watch again. Her answer is gonna be humble when I ask her about money. Watch this. This is so cool. Dili kayo rich, di put poor. I'm between. Ah, between, between. Oh, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. So you wanna say, oi? How much is how much is three thousand? Uh Philippines. Oh, how much is three thousand U.S. in pesos? Okay, so 150,000 pesos monthly. Hey, okay then. Okay, sha. Okay, so Mama's birthday wish is 100. 3,000. 3,000. I got confused whether we were talking about pesos or dollars. So. Ah, then. Damn. Much love, Mama. Much love, Mama. Oh, I, I'm sweaty, but I give you a, I give you a Quran, huh? Okay. That's how it is, guys. We're here. Province life. And of course, me and my brother-in-law, Levi, we had to drink. Now, what we're drinking right here is called Liston. That's one part Tandoi, one part iced tea, but mostly Tandoi and a little water. Yo, her dad has a really false sound system. I mean, it's thumping, dude. I'm kind of up now. Just a little bit. But yo, yo, I'm gonna ask my bro Levi to play the drums. And when I ask him to play the drums, what I'm talking about is imaginary drums. Just follow us, okay? Just follow us in your mind. Imaginary drums. Yo, bye. I'm gonna give you a three count, nigga. Let's go. One, two, three. Let's go. Much better most times, bro. 
He's just camera shy. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. Man, why are you shy, man? Why are you shy? I'm mostly wrong.